Hey guys, I'm Carl, and I got a request on how to do an L-seat, press the handstand on parallel bars. So here's a few drills and steps that I think will help, and let's get started. First, you should have a pretty good L-seat, and also a good handstand. And you should be comfortable coming down from a handstand, whether it's swinging down, pirouetting off to the side, or doing a handstand forward roll to upper arms. Some first steps are to work the negative or to do a handstand and come down on floor parallettes. I made a little ways back a tutorial on how to do a press handstand on the floor, but I'll go over some of that stuff in this video too. If you can't do a press handstand on the floor, you can start off by working a press headstand. And when you do a headstand, you're going to have your hands about here and put your head a little farther up since it's a triangle. And you can start off first off in just a tripod by placing your knees on your elbows and going up. And then you can do it from a straddle stand. And when you're ready, you can try a straddle press handstand on the floor. You're going to start off in a straddle stand. You're going to put your hands pretty close to your feet because if you put your hands too far out, you're going to end up planging and it's going to be a lot harder. So I would say put your hands about here and you're going to think about rolling your hips up. And you can also do a drag press handstand. There are a couple drills you can do on the floor that can help with thinking about rolling your hips up and getting into a nice pike position. And one's with the yoga ball. You're going to start off in a push-up position and just think about rolling your hips up and getting your hips over your head. And you can also do this with the panel mat. When you're ready, you can take them over to some parallettes that are a little bit higher up off the floor. And when you're ready, you can move them over to the parallel bars and start off trying them on the end. And the last step would be to do them in the middle of the parallel bars. And you really want to think about rolling your hips up and staying in a nice tight pike compression. That way when you straddle you won't hit the bars. So that's it for today's video. If you like this video, please hit that like button. And also feel free to subscribe if you're not already. And if you have any video requests you'd like to see, uh, please comment them down in the section below. And I'll see you guys in the next video.